First, I want to say um, my condolences goes out to everybody in Utah, the Utah organization, all the players and coaches, owners, and um, my thoughts and prayer goes out for a speedy recovery for Rudy Gobert. Um, he was tested positive for the, the virus. Um, it goes to show people nobody's immune to this virus. Now, they're going to be okay. They're healthy. Um, they'll get over it. But my only concern is the people who they came in contact with. Um, his own family. Um, strangers on the street shaking his hand. You know. This is real, folks. It's time. The time is now. Okay. The time is now to, to really think about putting this country on, on, on martial law that restricts everybody's movement, okay? Restrict everybody's movement for 21 days. Um, the NBA has canceled all games indefinitely, and who knows when the NBA will carry on again. Right now, it's not about basketball. It's not about making money for commercials. It's not about that. It's about protecting your livelihood and your health. Not only for yourself, but for everyone around you, including the fans. Um, their plan was to have no fans in the arena, but they're going to continue to play basketball. But now, since someone and the NBA caught the virus. Rudy Gobert, um, the Utah Jazz. Um, they're supposed to be playing Oklahoma tonight in Oklahoma. But Rudy said he, he feels fine. Um, he is going to play the game tonight. It just goes to show that Rudy's in great shape. He's healthy. He has a strong immune system. So he felt so good, he didn't realize he had it. And now the question is, how long has he had it? Where has he been before he got to the game? Did he go to a restaurant to eat? Did he go to a movie? Did he, you know, spend time with his loved ones? Everybody has to be quarantined now. And um, it's a sad situation, folks, but this is life. I've been, I made three videos about ventilation and, you know, quarantine yourself for three weeks. Um, and now I'm assuming they're watching my videos because now they start to listen. Um, even the, the federal government and the higher ups, they listen now. So I'm hoping... And I'm praying that each and every one of you out there listen and take heed. This virus is real, people. And it is lurking to get inside you. It is lurking to eat you inside out. And it's also lurking for the vulnerable ones that won't make it. So people, keep your distance, stay home for 21 days, quarantine yourself, and this will be over. It is time to put the world on martial law for 21 days. Come on. It's not that much to ask to save someone's life. It's not that much to ask so this thing can go away forever. It's not that much to ask to save someone that you love. It's not that much to ask for you not to be selfish. I hope every sports team, hockey, t 
tennis, baseball, car racing, wrestling, WWE, AEW, every organization in sports entertainment, the UFC, all take heed. Don't make it about money. Make it about people's health and well-being. It is time. It is time to put a lockdown on every single person in the world. Once again, I wish nothing but the best from the Utah Jazz and Rudy Goldberg and everybody in that organization. And I wish all the players around the world in every sport, non-sports, people around the world, just, just be vigilant, take care of yourself, and do the right thing. Quarantine yourself for three weeks. This will be over. Three weeks. Take care of yourself. Be safe. Have a great day and a great life.